It's been a really fascinating journey over the past three years because we've gone from a place where we're introducing new methods of procurement, so a, a challenge, a problem-based approach, to recognizing what are the skills that we need to underpin that. So this journey of the past three years has meant we've seen now the adoption of an entrepreneurship program, taking those entrepreneurial skills, bringing them into the public sector. And on top of that, is it hitting home? Well, absolutely, because we now have the creation of a new payments and commercial division, which is taking a number of the tenets of the SIPTEC program and seeing how we can adopt that to a much wider market within the public sector. SIPTEC 4 is looking to be a cracker. Uh, we've got a new, new cohort of challenge sponsors coming in, some return customers, others new. Uh, so again, getting our message out about new ways of working, new ways of thinking. Uh, the types of challenges are going to be varied, again, environment, uh, health, a whole spectrum. So it's, again, hugely exciting. But it's not just the challenge part. The other part is, what are the solutions that are going to come through the door? And that's where we have this magical blend of public sector challenges with entrepreneurial solutions. Taking just into account the first two cohorts, already over 80 jobs have been created. In terms of contracts, one been over five and a half million. Uh, and that's just the first two cohorts. 14 out of 17 of the companies are still going and accelerating. Um, we have some standout successes such as Symphonic uh, with their data access platform. Um, we have Rivertrack with their flood warning capability, which is now being rolled out uh, across parts of Scotland. And then, of course, we've got the SIPTEC 3 companies coming along, a different breed. There are countries from, acro companies from across the UK, some with significant investment. So again, showing the power of our brand and the, this challenge methodology in working with public sector partners to attract more sophisticated and bigger companies. So who knows what's going to come as part of SIPTEC 4, but the, the trajectory is upwards.